Hello Gemini, how are you? Welcome to my channel, Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So Gemini, this is your reading for the month of October and this is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid. Gemini, I would appreciate if you would hit like, share and subscribe and comment down below if you find yourself getting resonated with this reading. I would also request you to hit that notification bell so that you will be notified whenever I upload the video. There is an extended reading for this one. The link for the same is in description box and comment section. In the extended uh, Gemini, we will see what your person truly thinks and feels about you, what action they will take towards you, what is the likely conclusion between you and this person. All right. Okay. So let's get started. I'll shuffle the cards. I'll lay them down. And then Gemini will see what is your energy for the month of October. What is the energy of the person you are thinking about, you are dealing with, or you will be dealing with. Okay, and then I'll also pull out some Romance Angel Oracle cards and we'll see what are the romantic messages for you for the month of October. Too many cards. All right. So, Gemini, we have Seven of Pentacles for you. The Nine of Swords, Magician, and we have Eight of Swords. As far as your person is concerned, we have Queen of Cups, then we have Queen of Wands, uh, Ace of Swords, and we have Page of Pentacles. Let me pull out the Romance Angel Oracle cards. Uh, I'm going to discuss the Romance Angel Oracle cards at the fag end. Make sure you watch the video till the end, okay? Romantic messages. Nice. Very nice. Okay. Gemini, you may be dealing with another Gemini. You may be dealing with Virgo, Aries. Uh, you may be dealing with another air sign probably. Uh, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. I am hearing Cancer. Hmm... Yeah, Virgo is also standing out very strong. Let me show you the cards. Seven of Pentacles, Nine of Swords, The Magician, and Eight of Swords. Gemini, this is your spread. Okay. <clears throat> Number nine is of some importance. Uh, you may be saying 11-11. You may be saying triple one. Number eight is also of some importance. Right. So, Gemini. If there is any kind of worry uh, regarding your finances, if there are any financial issues that you are facing, you are going to manifest a resolution of those issues. Okay, say for example, if you have applied for a loan, but that is getting delayed, or maybe you're noticing whatever you're doing, your business or whatever you're doing, over there, your expenses are much more than the income that you are receiving. And probably you are under stress, or maybe some of you have lost your job, and you are noticing that your savings are exhausting day by day. And somehow, you're trying to understand why this is happening. You're trying to understand, is this what you really want to continue doing? Or there is something else that you want to, that you want to do in your life? There is a lot of contemplation that is going on. Okay? But what I see is, if there are any kind of issues regarding finances, you are going to find a solution for that. For some of you, you will also... Uh, resolve your financial issues by developing another source of income in the month of uh, October. Or at least you will start working in that direction. Okay. And uh, I would like to say that if you are thinking that I'm putting a lot of efforts, but I'm not getting the desired results or the desired outcome, then please do not worry. Please do not feel frustrated. Please do not... Uh, uh, get disappointed because you are going to receive the rewards it just that it is taking some time 
but when you are going to receive that you will be surprised with the like how how much of returns you are getting back like you will be you will be mind blown you will be like i never thought this is this is what i'm going to get back in return you will be like finally my hard work has paid off okay uh so there is a there is this amazing message around money i am also hearing that gemini you are a multi talented person and somehow you haven't tapped onto your true potential yet okay maybe you are stuck between what people are expecting from me what the society wants me to be what my family members want me to be what my friends expect me to be and what you really want okay you're doing things because there is a certain level of expectation from you from people around you and maybe you're not doing things that you really want to do and that is why i'm sensing there is a serious contemplation that will happen in the month of october which will which will help you realize certain things about yourself like oh uh i have i have this ability as well i have this kind of a skill set as well and maybe i need to focus in these areas also maybe i need to um uh, maybe i need to uh, you know tap onto this additional potential as well okay there is there is something that you really want to do from the bottom of your heart but maybe currently you are engaged in doing things to to please people around you or to fulfill the expectations that other people have from you okay with a magician card spirit wants me to say that do not forget that you have the powers uh, to manifest what you want you have the required uh, resources at your disposal to uh, fulfill your dreams and uh, bring your dreams into reality okay so the the what is needed is to understand from the bottom of your heart like what is it that you truly want okay what is it that will truly make you happy there is a there is a serious push and pull energy that is going on okay maybe maybe uh maybe you want to be creative is what i'm hearing you have a creative um inclination of mind as well whatever you are doing right now is probably uh, probably it it has a lot of logic it has a lot of uh intense intellectual activity is what i'm hearing but then you also need to it's not that you are absolutely disappointed with whatever you're doing but then you need some creative relief is also what i'm hearing so maybe you can pursue a hobby maybe you can start learning something about music or maybe you can start learning something about painting and drawing or sketching or maybe any any artistic hobby that you like or maybe there is something that you need to discover about yourself that will give you that satisfaction art will help you bring that much needed relief is what i'm hearing also gemini uh you you may want to uh rethink about the people that you allow to enter in your life you may want to rethink about uh putting too much trust on other people or putting too much of trust on to undeserving people because what i'm sensing is people are trying to enter in your life or people are actually being nice to you because they want to take some undue advantage from you okay and you there is a constant fight maybe you you your your intuition is trying to tell you something but in 3d reality you're not ready to believe uh what your intuition is trying to tell you you're like oh no this is a friend of mine i'm i'm friends with this person since last 10 years there is no there is no need for me to uh not to believe this person okay i will believe this person because i'm friends with that person since last 10 years maybe that person is doing something behind you behind your back or maybe that person is in touch with you uh because they are they are getting some kind of advantage from you okay so you have to rethink about 
uh, the people that you allow to uh, allow that you allow to enter in your life and i'm not saying that you should allow only those people who are beneficial to you i'm saying that he, people should be your well wisher people should not be a part of your life because they are able to extract something from you uh, people should not be a part of your life because you are giving them tremendous amount of benefits in some or the other form no okay it has to be uh, two ways there there has to be a nice trustworthy bond okay you should not feel that you are being misused you should not feel that you are being taken advantage of so there is something that you need to think because these people keep on extracting things from you and you only realize when they are done extracting from you and they are done uh, taking advantage from you and then they move to another person and when they are out of your life then you realize oh this person was in my life to take some und uh, undue advantage from me okay so you may want to think about the kind of people that you allow to enter in your life okay and also i see that you probably are stuck with someone from the past there is an energy where you are trying to um you are trying to fight with yourself gemini you are trying to fight with yourself now this can be anyone this can be a past friend this can be a past romantic partner this can be a past past person who was closely associated to you okay can be a boss can be a friend can be a family member can be your past romantic partner can be anyone okay you are having a hard time forgetting this person you are having a hard time moving away from this person you are having a hard time cutting the cords with this person okay so you maybe this person did something they with the nine of swords i can see that there was someone in the past who was very close to you but this person ended up betraying you okay and and that that hurt that damage you are still carrying within you 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 need to distance yourself from that you need to cut the cords with this person the you're not i mean i i see a struggle it's not that you want to remain connected with that person no but i see a struggle uh, you are struggling to forget this person you are struggling to uh, disconnect the cords with this person i would suggest you do some meditation i would suggest you write down that i am happily moving on okay uh if 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 uh, you you if you really want to cut the cords with this person then there there are multiple rituals on the on youtube where you can see that uh, how to cut cut the cords with the person okay and any ritual if you do that from the bottom of your heart you will be able to find success in that okay all right as far as your person is concerned gemini we have queen of cups queen of wands ace of swords and page of pentacles gemini there is someone who is interested in you but this person also had a difficult past okay and they have been betrayed multiple times by their previous partners and they are having a difficult time in trusting other people they they are finding themselves uh, getting emotionally inclined towards you okay but then they are trying to portray this persona that uh, i i don't care okay we are talking fine uh or th this person is putting a facade when they are dealing with you or when they see you this person is putting a facade that they are not even noticing you or they don't know who you are okay but this person they they have very strong feelings for you but at the same time because of the insecurities and because of the uh difficult past they had with their previous partners this this person is portraying a very strong persona i mean many of you don't even know who this person is because this person is not allowing themselves uh to expose to you they are not allowing their feelings to get exposed so this person is definitely in and around you but they are putting a serious facade they are putting a mask 
and they are not allowing to leak <laughs> their emotions in any way but with the ace of swords maybe some some communication may happen in the near future uh, this person may take may take a different approach they may try to become a friend of yours first gemini and then there afterwards uh, they may they they will try to win your trust they will try to make you comfortable they will try to show you that they are a trustworthy person and then probably they will reveal their true feelings okay and they during that time when they are trying to win your trust during that time they are also they will also analyze you whether you are trustworthy or not because of the fact again i'm telling you this person had a difficult past they have been betrayed multiple times and they don't want to repeat their past again so they will take the time to uh, to to win your trust at the same time they will also take the time to understand uh, what they are thinking of you uh, is getting validated right i mean they they are having a amazing image about you in their mind they just want to validate that by interacting with you by getting to know about you uh if any one of you are already in in a relationship with someone i i see some serious communication happening between you and your person okay something related to a serious topic right now both of you are on different pages both of you probably are not aligned regarding thought processes but a communication may happen which may help in this alignment okay like say for example you if you are in a relationship with someone then this scenario is applicable to you guys uh, say for example you are uh, you you expect to get married to this person sooner and that person your your partner is not denying marriage but probably they are saying that they need some more time so right now you both of you are on different pages okay but then expect some important communication in the month of october which will bring both of you on the same page which will help both of you get aligned nevertheless i see a very important communication happening in the month of uh, october rel related to love and relationships okay and you you will there is a likelihood that you will uh, get into a relationship which is looking promising okay even if you are single right now there is a strong possibility of you finding someone and not just finding someone but the relationship that person is going to offer you uh, they will come with a lot of stability okay they the relationship will look quite balanced uh, not something that you had experienced in the past right so gemini now let's talk about the romance angel oracle cards so we have trust this situation is calling for you to have faith i told you right you and your person both of you are in 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 a uh different alignment and and maybe you 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 may start doubting this person or oh, whether this person they they have intentions to marry me or they don't have intentions to marry me and they're just playing around with me no have some trust is what what the card is saying children your love life is being affected by children for some of you you have kids and uh, majority of your time is getting consumed because of them separation apart time apart from your partner is on the horizon then we have unrequited love there is not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going for some of you maybe when it comes to unrequited love i don't think so this is a, a scenario for the current uh, ongoing situation probably this is something that has already happened in the past your love was not reciprocated and that is a scenario of the past make the effort great love is worth taking the steps you are guided to take listen to your intuition i am again coming back to the same point you got to listen to your intuition your intuition will always be a guiding factor okay 
All right, take care of yourself and have a great time ahead. And remember, there is an extended reading. The link for the same is in the description box and comment section. In the extended reading, we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you, what action they will take towards you, and what is the likely conclusion between you and this person. All right, take care of yourself, Gemini, and have a great time ahead. Bye-bye.